It is such a, a pleasure to have you here. Thank you for coming, man. Thank, Thank you for you. being in the audience today. Yeah. Are you having a good time? It looks like you're having a good time. I'm having oh, a sorry. Ball. Let me give you that mic right here. Boom. I am having a ball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And see, we actually know who you are. You are a teacher from New Jersey, and we, we had to hear from you. Tell us about your school and your students, man. Man, um, first of all, I'm excited. Thank yeah. you, thank you, thank you. Um, I teach at Marion P. Thomas Charter High School in Newark, New Jersey. Mm -hmm. It is, yeah, come on, come on, Marion P. Newark, Newark, Newark. <laughs> um, we're a Title I public charter high school in Newark, and we just believe in the sense of community. Mm -hmm. It's in a lower income community, mm -hmm. but we have some great, great, wonderful people that mm -hmm. come out of this city. Mm -hmm. A lot of creatives, a lot of entre entrepreneurs, a lot of hustlers. Yes. So this school basically represents all of that, and we just give these kids a way to express themselves and be their authentic selves every yes. single day. Yes, I love it. I mean, how can you not love that, right? Now, you, are, you also work in special education. Why in special education? Yes, I am a special needs educator. Mm -hmm. um, I chose... Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. um, I chose special education because I saw that there wasn't a lot of resources for families or mm -hmm. children affected by autism. Mm -hmm. A lot of people didn't know how to, you know, um, correlate or how to mm -hmm. deal with the stigma of autism. Mm -hmm. So I just wanted to be an advocate for those children because they were left out of a lot of things. Mm -hmm. You know, certain field trips they couldn't go on to, they were just kind of stuck in a classroom. Right. Right. And I wanted them to have the same opportunities as everyone else or whatnot. So that's why I kind of went into special education because I wanted I them that. to feel special just as well as we do. I love that. I love that. And, you, and see, we can, feel, we can feel the love and the passion that you have here. And I know that you go above and beyond for your students, even if it's um, going out of pocket to pay for supplies or, or, or doing all that. What, like, tell us about what they need and, and, and why you feel the need to also do this to help with that. Well, I have to do it because these are my babies. Mm. I don't have biological children right. of my own. So I'm a father to hundreds and hundreds and hundreds right. of kids every single year. Um, and I do what I do because I can't see them come to school with certain things that they're lacking or certain necessities mm -hmm. and resources that they're lacking and mm -hmm. not do something about it. As mm -hmm. again, these are my babies. So if it's a haircut that they need to get, I'm getting them that haircut. Mm. If they need braids, I'm getting them them braids. If they need shoes, I'm getting those shoes. Mm -hmm. And I use my own personal salary to fund all of these different things for them. Mm -hmm. And I don't care because they're my babies. Yes, absolutely. And see, not only are you doing that, that's incredible, but you also run a mentorship program called Boys to Men. Tell oh, us about man. that. Man. Uh, now, this is something I'm very excited about because Boys to Men mm -hmm. is a not, a, well, not a nonprofit, it's a mentoring program mm -hmm. housed out of Marion P. Thomas Charter High School that I started actually this year. And I saw that a lot of our students just did not have the means of expressing themselves, especially mm -hmm. our young black and brown boys. Mm -hmm. And a lot of them were faced with a lot of drug presence and, and gang presence. Mm -hmm. So I just wanted them to have a, a, a space where they can come together and actually know that if I have a teacher that's sitting in front of me that made it out, I can make it out right, too. Right. So they're actually doing some amazing things even in the community. They mm -hmm. decided they wanted themselves to go out in the community, community and clean up the community, mm -hmm. do clean up sweeps. Mm -hmm. We actually just over the holiday season donated over 100 coats to the less fortunate in the North community. So yes. I think that's amazing. Absolutely. Amazing. Absolutely. And also, you mentioned, you know what, you mentioned, it, you mentioned nonprofit. I know you just opened a nonprofit. Please tell us what, I, what that's about. Well, about. Victim to Victor Outreach is a nonprofit that I started in 2017. Mm -hmm. And it's just all things community. We've done scholarships for kids that want to go back to school, you know what I'm saying? Or kids that's going into school that don't have the means of providing or buying mm -hmm. their books. Mm -hmm. So I do $200, $250 scholarships about two or three times out of the year. Mm -hmm. We're going to community feed all these commu um, the, the community people. We just mm -hmm. go out and feed them. Um, we do a lot of amazing things. Love it. I love it. Isn't it amazing? It's amazing. Oh, it's a lot of love oh, right here. Man. Listen, oh. we, we have more with Jaleel. Go to our website and learn how you can support Jaleel and his nonprofit. We're going to play a game for the chance to win a prize uh -oh. after this break. Stay with us. Richard. We're back with the incredible New Jersey teacher, Jaleel Richwood. Now, listen, I want to say this, too, is that uh, it's, it's also so important, um, not only what you're doing, but also... Uh, the way that you that you are taking up space and putting in so much inspiration and love, um, especially as a black man, as a teacher, the the population of of, of teachers that are black men are, are I mean it's it's very very small. I had 
two in my entire life. Wow. Right? wow. So what you're doing for your students and, what, and the way that you're showing up for them is 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 really creating new paths, man. And I'm gonna give you, I want to give you your flowers for that. Appreciate That's amazing. It really is. Thank you so much. Now listen, I know that you are. You're, you're funding your nonprofit, your nonprofit out of pocket, um, and you know we, we want to help with that. So uh, I had an idea, and I said, and there's something. See, I, I see that you wear hats. You're like a I hat guy. Hats. I also love hats myself. You actually got on the fedora, and that's no. normally what I wear every day. You see, and what's crazy is I wore that uh -oh. here. Look, look uh -huh. at that. Look you at that. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. 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 So I, it okay. gave me an idea for a game. Here's how it's gonna work. Okay, there's gonna be three hats behind us, and under each hat is a different prize, all right? So you pick the hat, you get the prize. Okay. Easy enough? Okay, yeah. Okay, all right. Let's okay. do it. All right, okay. All right, which hat do you want to pick? I'm gonna go with the, I'm gonna go with the third, the third hat, the third. The third, the third hat? Yeah, we're okay. gonna mix it up He's a little going bit. with number three. Go with number three. Yeah, okay, number three. Let's see what we got. Oh, man, <laughs> you want, is those even you wanna, still out? You want a brand new VCR, bro. Is those even out that's, still? That's, some, that's pretty amazing. That's amazing that, that, that we, amazing, yeah, it's amazing that, we found, that we found one of those. That's amazing. Uh, <laughs> you know what, but it, you know what, it, it's my show today, so I'm gonna give you one more chance. Let, okay. Pick another hat, man, pick another hat. What did y'all say? Yeah. Sounds like they said. I think I'm, I think I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with one. I'm okay, with one. one it is, let's see what we got. <laughs> there we go. Yes. God is good. This season, God is good. we have partnered Woo! with Tis Best, and they want to give you $10,000. To experience the true power of giving, visit tisbest.org. I want to thank Jenna Duan, Jordan Davis, and Jabari Banks. I want to thank my friend Ellen for asking me to host again, and I want to thank all of y'all for watching. Have a great, wonderful weekend. Spread the love, spread the smiles. Bye.